emergency. We've, uh, we've lost our right wheel. For the first time, audio from inside the cockpit during an emergency landing near Raleigh, North Carolina. How do you intend to land at Raleigh, Durham? Get as slow as we can, and I guess we're going to put it on the belly. The twin-engine turboprop plane seen barreling past emergency vehicles before skidding off the runway and spinning to a stop. The plane took off with two pilots. We had two persons on board. But landed with only one inside. We do have one subject um, who is not on the aircraft. Soul number two jumped from the aircraft. Unknown location, did not have a parachute. Police say Charles Hugh Crux, the 23-year-old co-pilot, either jumped or fell from the plane mid-flight and without a parachute. Now, a deepening mystery over what happened to Crux. There's no mention of the pilot exiting the aircraft on the recordings. After an hour's long search Friday, his body found in a backyard, roughly 30 miles from where the plane landed. We had officers that were responding in the area for the search and were flagged down by a resident. Uh, they had heard something in their backyard. Crux's family tonight reeling from their loss. We are totally devastated. Ch Charlie was born to fly. He, from the time he was a little kid, it, it just lit him up. It was always, always his passion. The other pilot, whose identity is still unknown, was taken to the hospital and treated for minor injuries. The FAA and National Transportation Safety Board are still investigating. Do you feel like you need answers in order to have closure? No. I mean, as a family, the only thing that matters, unfortunately, is that he's gone. He was the best. Yeah. Yeah. Priscilla Thompson, NBC News.